Hey guys, Dr. Sage, the king of cracks here with your home tip of the day for part two of shoulder blade pain. So last time we discussed using a massage ball behind the shoulder blade to go through ranges of motion of the shoulder to really release a lot of tension in between the spine and that shoulder blade. So this time we wanna focus on the anterior muscles that connect to our shoulder blade. Some of the biggest culprits you'll see is our pec minor that connects from our ribs to the coracoid process right in our shoulder blade and also the serratus anterior muscle that connects from our rib cage to the medial border of the scapula and also the posterior delt coming into some of the rotator cuff muscles. So what you wanna do is grab yourself a nice massage tool and use your sternum as a guide. Start at the internal portion of your pec major muscle and massage outward towards your shoulder in this fashion. So after you're done working on the pec major muscles and really working up into that coracoid process, you can progress by raising your arm up and starting to work a lot of the serratus anterior muscles, your subscap, and also the posterior delt. A lot of these muscles take pressure off the scapula and allow the body to get back in better posture, alleviating tension from the neck, headaches, and also in between their shoulder blades. So give those a try and let me know what you think.